we found a tick on Cooper. So we're just checking the dogs over. It's been some surprise that they haven't got it sooner because they've been all over Cooper Scotland here. and that Cooper. and they've got so many deer. Cooper here. <laughs> Cooper doesn't want the tick taken off, it's his new friend. Oi. I don't know if you've seen these before, but this is a tick removing tool. And they're really good, so he's got a little tick. Which side was it? Here, somewhere, there. So he's got a little tick just there. You just turn it. Oh. Yeah. And you drop it on the floor. And the tick falls off. Yeah, so you, you hook the tick right at the base. And you've got to get it right at the base. And then you turn it anti-clockwise. And it comes out in its entirety. So all of its legs and everything are there. Horrible things. With a bit of Cooper's hair. Is it bad? But you can see the whole tick is there. So you never end up with bits left in them. You're a big baby really, ain't you? Well, you ain't got any more. Cooper ain't got any more. I've decided enough is enough. I'm going to get a haircut. And see my underwater video yesterday didn't help. So I'm going to go and get a haircut. And there we have it. I've had a haircut. First time in over a year, and my head's freezing. <laughs> <laughs> so we've had a few days off. We've had some downtime, haven't we? Some family came over and we all pitched up on a campsite. Yeah, it's over, um, it's Dunnage. We're parked at Dunnage now. The campsite is kind of right at the coast, isn't it? On cliff tops. And because uh, we had a few days off just to relax and spend time, we didn't do any footage. But we'll drop a link in the descriptions, I think, to yeah. their site because it's a really, really nice site. And we paid like eighteen pound a night. Yeah, yeah. And it is like dead on the beach, so it's brilliant. That's with electric yeah. hookup and everything, isn't it? Yeah, and there's really, really nice walks. You can walk south down to this National Trust place, isn't there? We yeah. walk down, it's shut this time of year. <laughs> yeah, we but... didn't have very eventful. <laughs> we want the coffee, and we walked <laughs> just about coffee. two miles north on the beach, <laughs> didn't we? To a little. Um, cafe place and that shut yeah. about 10 minutes before we got there so we walked back and it's like the next day I walked the other way because there's a National Trust coffee shop and we walked there and that's shut for the winter so <laughs> we didn't get our coffee but the kids we? had to play in the park it's actually <laughs> such a nice day like blue skies a lot wasn't yeah. it we got photos we didn't take any video did we? yeah so we'll do a post on it on our Facebook and Instagram um, but we did eventually walk up the other way a couple of days later and we got fish and chips and um, a, coffee. a coffee at another little beach cafe type place yeah. wasn't there so that's really nice as well right on the beach massive car park as well so no no worries at all parking anything no in we there. might go and grab a coffee this morning might so we Definitely. stayed we stayed here a year ago around, around yeah. a year ago when we first came back from europe last, in the sprinter. last time in the sprinter yeah. and it was in this exact spot actually yeah. um this is very i don't think we're here at weekends will we I don't, can't remember, but it, there wasn't any other vans here at all. No. But there's so many more vans here now, like everywhere we're going yeah. in the UK compared to before. But we spent a night last night here. Uh, there was another van here last night. Um, and there's a motorhome turned up this morning. So When we got here yesterday, people were parked over here. So it's still reasonably early. There's plenty of parking spaces left. But when we stay places for free, we like to vacate so we don't take up too many parking spaces, don't we? No, the sprinter, we took up that whole little lay-by area there with the sprinter. And there was a little bit here when we turned up yesterday. Yeah, there was a little... Um, the panel vans, didn't they? But, yeah, but they're yeah, like... Yeah, coach-built panel van type thing. It's not coach-built, is it? But Just like, yeah. A factory-built panel van was here, and they, they parked right in the middle anyway. <laughs> How big do you reckon it was? Six metres? Yeah, probably six metres. So, and you still couldn't park here, so... Yeah, we're bigger, but we're not actually... You can't park here regardless what you've got here. Um, we had a very peaceful night's sleep, didn't we? Yeah. Nobody about, other and than the other van. I was going to say, we've sorted our tanks out as well, so we can carry, like, now, was it 200 more litres of water? Yeah, so for free so, camping and stuff. Oh, it's we... so much better. So we're heading down to the little cafe at Dunnage now. We just stone throw away from where we were, wasn't it? Yes. And we're just going to come down here and grab a coffee. But there's Lou's here. 
I don't know what time they shut the toilets, but they're open the whole time we've been here. And this is a car park, huge. And the cafe that's not open yet, they're all waiting. It says 10 o'clock, what's the time? 10 Five past 10, oh, hello. We've just got a coffee from Flora's Cafe, Dunwich. So it's just down on the heath. It's a huge, huge car park and the little cafe's there. The amount of people that come here for the beach. And it's a really lovely beach, so it's not commercial. I don't know if you can hear me. Yeah. So it's a really lovely beach. It's not commercial. There's not really a lot here. So if you like walking and you've got a dog, this is perfect. There's a lot of fishing as well, isn't there? Yeah. I think they were doing night fishing the other night as well. So it's really lovely. For us, this is right up our street. It's not, there's there's no arcades, there's nothing like that, is there? No. Um, but literally, over that little mound there is the beach. We like Dunwich, don't we? We do. I think a lot of other people do as well. There's loads of friendly people here. Loads of friendly dogs. And it's just nice. Yeah, you'll probably see. And we've you. collected sea glass. We you? have collected sea glass. I've got varying colours and some of it's quite nice. occasionally see it flash. Don't know if you can pick it up on the video. There. there you go. <laughs> but it's just nice miles and miles of walks. Dog friendly. And the campsite we stayed on is literally up there. Yeah just down the beach there on the right. And there's steps down onto the beach. is the campsite that was cliff top house campsite and there's the ship pub here we didn't go in there actually no we didn't we'll easily get through there continue on the road I did hear bells ring. 